What's up, Fight Fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Joe Joyce and Michael Wallish. These guys fought a hard three rounds. Michael Wallish, as long as he lasted, he made a good account of himself. In the first round, he was catching Joe Joyce with right hands. And you can tell by the second round, Joe Joyce made the proper adjustments of letting them graze, you know, so he started rubbernecking that right to, to, to stop it from hitting and landing the way it did because I don't think Joe Joyce liked that right hand too much. Um, what I seen about Joe Joyce, um, I seen ring rust, I did see that. I saw him, he looked even slower than he did in normal fights. I know he's not a fast fighter, so I get it, but he looked even slower. That Again, that could have been two ring rust. He got caught with shots I didn't care for. Michael Wallace was a good opponent for him because he was a tough guy and he was game as long as it lasted, okay? When he, he started going to the body early, which was good for the juggernaut, he pretty much walked through a lot of those shots that Wallace uh, hit him with. And I think Wallace is a decent puncher. You know, I heard those studding blows, but you heard also those studding blows from Joe Joyce. So I'm looking at it like, okay, these guys are like rock'em, sock'em robots. They had the same speed of punches. And I'm looking at it and I'm like, okay, what would Danny Dubois do? And by the way, Danny Dubois already defeated Michael Wallace. And it's just a great comparison, especially when you have a common opponent. Now, Joe Joyce, is, he's, he's game. Um, he started landing and putting together those body shots. I think that's what broke him down because you can tell by the second round, Wallace was starting to tire anyway. So he put, you know, interest in the bank with those body shots, taking Wallace out. It was a good display of punches. But again, I didn't like how he was um, getting hit. And I'm glad that he decided to use some defense finally. And again, that happened in the second round when he started to see that right coming because these guys are slow guys, let's face it. So you've seen it coming from back here where he was going to throw it. So. Um, a good display, uh, a good welcoming back for Joe Joyce as he has finished his project, so to speak. Now he's waiting for the big fight with Triple D. Now it's Triple D's turn. But anyway, um, it was a good stoppage. Great. Um, you guys tell me what you think of Joe the Juggernaut Joyce stopping Michael Wallace. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys can counterpunch. Peace.